father of Singapore with such fear and trepidation. Do you uh, potentially foresee a time where you don't actually have to send your plays to get vetted to be approved before they can be staged? No. <laughs> it's just, I mean, if you look at, you know, um, homosexuality and, and, and it's still not legal <laughs> and that is a bigger issue than submitting a, a lousy script you know to be vetted. You cannot present any kind of positive gay role models on TV yeah and in film it's always kind of you know described I mean it, it, it's helpful if a gay person dies yeah. or suffers for being gay I mean that's always yeah okay let's let that go. This house will always be ruled by straight men People like you with your fancy ideas don't belong here. So the father kicks the boy out of the house. And what does the boy do? He cried. <laughs> You're sort of TV. I do sort of idealistically see a time when writers in the future will stop doing it. Stop submitting scripts. Stop submitting and take the risks of, of just performing it without a license. I, 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 I'm not saying that we are not gutsy. <laughs> I'm not putting us down. We are but gutsy I, and law abiding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But when the law is wrong, you just got to break it, right? Yeah, I do see, you know, potentially an act of civil disobedience one day in the future that might just reveal how absurd actually some of these uh, laws are.